Hey guys, what's up? I hope everyone is having a super amazing day. Let's just do a couple of um let's do a couple of collective readings here. <laughs> let's get all right. So first up, what's going on with the collective in love? I want to do what's going on with Scorpio in love, right? But let's do a collective reading and then I'll come back and do a Scorpio. All right, collective in love. What's going on this week or today? What messages do we need to know? Oh shit, nine of wands. Oh, <laughs> Well, persevere, man. Don't give up. If you want. <laughs> like, I, I, dis, I disagree, man. I disagree. <laughs> Nine of Wands, persevere, keep going. There's a bit of a struggle, but you can work through it if you want. Oh, my G. There's a, there's a struggle with the Queen of Cups. Oh, collective. Let's clarify this Queen of Cups. Should you trust her? Oh my God, the Queen of Cups is an OnlyFans model. Oh man, I don't know if you should trust this Queen of Cups. All right, next, next. So maybe you're going to meet this Queen of Cups somewhere interesting. All right, well, don't give up on your Queen of Cups, man. Oh shit, seven of coins. Well, this is, uh, don't spend any money that you don't have, you know, hold on, long-term view. Um, but this looks actually pretty good. Don't give up on a Queen of Cups. Maybe there's an OnlyFans thing involved. There could be some, you know, this possibility for long-term growth in this situation. Let's clarify this seven of coins. What's the deal? Is any money coming in? This is a love reading, but, and I doubt, you know, maybe it's someone from the past. Maybe it's someone that you have a real long-term connection with. Then again, the sevens I look at is putting the brakes on, but whatever. Oh, wow. Big money is coming in. Oh, whoa. All right. Collective. All right. I know this is a love reading, but okay, next. What's next? Ace of coins reverse. Well, watch out. There might be some kind of new beginning or some kind of new um, financial opportunity that's not quite getting off the ground and it's a little bit slow for you. It might be dragging you out. Six of swords reverse. You're having difficulty leaving a situation or maybe you left a situation recently and you're like getting sucked back into it. It's like an ex who's an OnlyFans model who wants your big money. <laughs> oh, man. I love these little ghosty cards. All right. Well, look, this money situation, there's potential for a new beginning, or you thought there was potential for a new beginning. Like, this is a love reading, but the Six of Swords reverse is like, you're trying to get out of the situation, or there's a bit of dishonesty, or someone's run away from you, and they're running back to you. <laughs> it's like, it's a little bit not so banana. You guys want to clarify this? You guys should know who this is, Collective. Like, there's an ex who wants back in your life. And I don't say that's a bad thing. Although I have a little PTSD, <laughs> but like, what do you think? Oh no, dry spell. Oh no, you guys have a dry spell coming up. All right, forget it. Forget it. Love's not going to happen. Love's not going to happen. Next, Knight of Swords. There you go. So there's a, conf there's like running around, you know, rushing around, communicating, lack of communicating, someone, lack of communication. Someone might be lying to you. Wow, that's not cool, man. Well, collective, watch out for it. But whatever. This doesn't look the greatest for love. Oh, man. Girl with glasses. Okay, so keep your eyes open. Glasses. All right, so maybe you're not going to see all of this running around. Or maybe you're not going to see this dry spell coming. Or maybe you're not going to Maybe you're not gonna see it. All of the other tarot readers are saying there's someone coming. I don't know. I'm like, I don't know. It's, don't it's, it's like very much. It's the Six of Swords is very much the card of going away. <laughs> Right, and there's miscommunication or someone's lying to you and the money's not the greatest. All right, guys, well, that kind of poopy bananas. Let's see what else is going on here for the collective. Oh, man, Eight of Swords. I guess the blinders are coming off. In some way, the blinders are coming off for everybody. Maybe you're starting to see the truth. This doesn't look like you're seeing the truth, but the glasses card, girl with glasses, kind of asking you to look a little deeper into the situation. Da -na -na -na, two of Cups reversed. Go, sonny. <laughs> it's a, what do you think? Well, maybe it didn't work out. Maybe it did work out. Maybe there's some lovers from the background in the background <laughs> from the past returning. Maybe I'm going to be optimistic. Maybe there's some lovers from the past returning. Let's take one more of these little ghosty cards and then we'll we'll ask another collective question. So this is love. Oh, man, girl with brains. There you go. Maybe you're going to meet a girl with brains. That would work. <laughs> I would dig that. <laughs> Look at this. Well, figure it out, man. Figure it out. Something is screwy in this collective love experience. Whatever it is, the collective love experience is not so good. So use your brains and figure it out, right? Look twice. 
You're right. Double check. Look twice. You obviously pissed somebody off. <laughs> Collective, you already pissed somebody off. And they kicked your ass to the curb, man. <laughs> only fans. You wish you was. You, you wish you, <laughs> you were our only fan. <laughs> oh, man. I love these little cards. All right. So we did collective love. Let's do a little collective money. See what's going on here. I could use an infusion right now. <laughs> I think everybody could use a little infusion. This tax season caught me off guard, man. <laughs> so it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna put some kind of thing in a thing. <laughs> so, but we all gotta be cool. All right, here we go. So let's go see what's going on. So that was love. It looks like someone from the past is coming back, but we know that astrologically collective. What about money? Is there going to be any good money for anybody here? So I get it, right? Two of Cups reversed. It didn't really work out. Someone's, you know, or someone uh, rescinding an offer. Um, just be cool with everything this week. You know, it's I'll, when I see you guys when I'm live later and we do some astral stalking, I'll show you guys. I'll tell you. We'll do it. It'll be okay. All right, so what's going on with the collective with the money this week? Oh, shit. <laughs> You're waiting to hear I'm on something, and it ain't coming. <laughs> that news you were hoping for, you ain't going to hear it. Ah, uh, Seven of Cups. So many decisions. Wow. I don't know if they're all good decisions. Let's see what's going on. What is this with money? Lack of, this is a different reading, right? This is all about options and not recognizing your options or being paralyzed. Oh, wow, you're super lucky. Holy smokes, guys. Wow, money's super lucky with money. All right. The hanged one, some illusions with money or seeing through the illusions, right? It's reversed. Let's pick another card here. Red flag. Watch out. There's a red flag. So there's an illusion. There's some kind of, there might be some deception here. Financially, you're super lucky, but don't rush into anything. But the seven of cups, you're not going to rush into anything anyways. The death card. Well, that's easy. There's an ending, some kind of financial ending. Maybe some of you guys quit your jobs. I, uh, you know, yeah, maybe. <laughs> or maybe there's a lot of problems with money. Just be careful. You're super lucky, but there are a lot of red flags. And although you're starting to see things more clearly, maybe somebody was bullshitting you. Or this seems to be like a fuck up in the background. Four of coins. Yeah, hold on to your money. Whatever you do, hold on to it. All right, next. There's an ending. So you got to hold on to your money. Okay, next. What else is happening? Oh, wow. Love spell. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> wow, there's a love spell right in the middle of all of this. But we're doing a money reading. So what's next? Oh, my God. Sexy fun time. <laughs> wow. Sexy fun time and a love spell. Well, love wants to come out. <laughs> like, oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, collective. Okay, well, there you go. Regardless, hold on to your money. And then we have, oh, my God, this motherfucker again. Six of Swords reversed. Oh, man. Oh, man, this looks like, wow. Well, you're going to end a situation. Maybe some of you guys were in a bit of an office romance. That's a little bit weird. <laughs> it's like, I guess. But like, sexy fun time. There you go. What's going on? You can't get out of this Six of Swords situation. You just can't shake them. Oh my God! Someone is using sex magic on you. There's some. The reason you can't escape is because she's one fine. She's fine. <laughs> she's one fine ass piece of work. <laughs> so I don't want. Do I have any cards for cuckoo bananas? All right, here we go. Oh man. Well, the chariot's reversed. Maybe someone's trying to come and visit you and they can't. Oh, that looks sounds scary. <laughs> All right. Or stuff. Someone's spinning their wheels, or there's slow movement, or a victory's reversed. Um. Although it looks like there's an end. It does look like there's an ending. It looks like you're not seeing things clearly. Someone's trying not to to get away. There are some red flags here. Although you're super lucky, and there's definitely sex magic in play. Da -na -na -na, and Ace of Wands is reversed. So I don't know, man. I would recommend trying again. <laughs> well, astrologically, you know, people from the past are going to return. Just try it again. Oh, man, I pulled two cards out by accident. So one card that really wants to come out is the Ghost card. And there's also a collaboration, guys. So if you guys are working, like maybe you're going to have an office romance or maybe someone who ghosted you that you used to work with or someone that you used to know together happen but is it gonna work out you know what let's pull one more card and see if it's gonna work out <laughs> maybe we're gonna get a green light is it gonna work out 
Okay, here we go. Come on, collective. Is it going to work out? So it looks like a collaboration or someone you didn't... I think this is actually pretty good. For a money reading, this is like sexy fun time, love spell, sex magic. You know, maybe it didn't work out first the first time. There's some red flags, indecision, but you guys are super lucky. Okay, let's see what it says. Da -na -na -na. Only fans again. These aren't my only like there are other car there's only one only fans girl in this deck. Right? There are a couple of ghosts and, and then motorcycle freedom. You guys are looking for your freedom. And on the bottom of the deck, well, we have big money again at the bottom of the deck. Big money. We have big money. Road trip and best friends. So <laughs> There you go, guys. There you go, Collective. I hope everyone has a super amazing day. Share the videos. Give the video a thumbs up. Leave your comments. And I wish everyone the best. I'm going to do a Scorpio thing like this in a second. I'll see you guys soon.